Welcome to Dan ARG YouTube. Emmanuel Aigbogun say person we ki soja man wife for Benin City for Edo State. Go Abuja, go carry police, come take arrest people for a warmer community for Benin. Make I leave you, make you hear from Emmanuel Aigbogun. Yes, 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 yes. A warm good morning to you all my conscious Edo people. I remain no other person than your noble right activist, Comrade I. Bogu Emmanuel. Uh, this very morning, if you're watching me, I know the I vex because as the caption goes, a woman, my community, police, army, and government. What is going on? Because for me, it, it pains my heart that each time around we keep on lamenting and crying and narrating our own security agencies and the reason for doing this is that the majority of these operatives that they carry around as their workers or whatever they call them or as operatives what they do is just solely to make money in their pocket to the detriment of our laws to the detriment of peace to the detriment of peaceful coexistence among the majority of these communities now what is paining me this morning Last night, I, had, I started reaching out to relevant authorities to draw their attention to this plight. But I think the best thing for us to go is to let the Chief of Army staff, let the uh, NSA, let the Inspector General Police know. Because what is actually going on is that it's obvious that these boys don't no longer respect directives anymore. It's obvious that what they are doing is just a clear act of robbery in the name of police. Now, what has transpired? Two years ago, I was very much aware, a lot of Edo populace was very much aware that in the Womama community, there's one knowing, one boy they call knowing, he killed him and his boys, they killed a Sujaman's wife. CCTV footage was able to identify them, and at the end of the day, they were charged to court. This same boy has not attended court for the past uh, four sittings. He has a murder case on his neck. All of a sudden, is in Abuja with SWAT police. Being in Abuja with SWAT police, he has started writing petitions. Petitions to arrest the community leadership because he wants to be chairman. Now, before saying anything, before saying anything, because I will be in the 4th Brigade today, I will also see the Commissioner of Police, and if possible, within the week, I will be in Abuja in a protest to the first headquarters because what you guys are doing in Benin is just aiding these land grabbers. It pains me that it's a, a human being will write petition, and the petition he has written, he did not report it in state CID, he did not report it in zone five, he did not report the matter in the division where all these things happened. He will run to Abuja, particularly that SWAT unit. I don't know what they are doing in that SWAT. That SWAT unit, he will run there. The moment they see petition and they see money, oh my God, let's go and kill the person. Now, what what's currently paining me? is I want you guys to listen to this voice record and video that I just got yesterday evening. It's been beating my imagination. I've been trying to reach out to relevant authorities. They seem not to be not to be not to be concerned. They seem to be very busy. Why? They are putting people in incarceration for a criminal. Then tomorrow they will say Benin is no longer peaceful. Tomorrow they will say police is this, police is that. I want you guys to please watch this video and listen very carefully particularly towards the end of this video and after this live broadcast i'll be posting this video on my wall for the world to see and i will post it side by side with the charge of this knowing and four others that were arrested for murder and because of the you know social media doesn't allow us to post uh, all those uh, violent pictures that have emanated from bullet wounds or they about because of the uh, society uh, uh, clearance now let me let me play this video for you guys, where you will hear, you will hear where somebody saying, you know how much I don't spend. Let me meet the talker now. Now the person will go spend the money. Now in the inside moto, they record police. They use Nigerian police force. They use Nigerian police, particularly SWAT. SWAT will be a tactical unit of the police. We're supposed to they boss criminals. Now criminals they use them because of money. Because of money, I, I see Nigeria. Eh? Oh, all this in our police, that's not a shame. Even if we don't get work on the do, we don't go see us on ourselves. We don't go help make this country better. 
Not be any smart thing that they blame Tinubu, any smart thing that they blame governor. Any police were supposed to maintain law and order. Now now they misorder the order. Now now they misorder the order. Now now they misorder the order. To the extent we be saying now criminals now don't they use now. They go they they go they carry out lawful activities. Somebody we don't miss court cities for how long? He never go court. He don't jump. He don't, he don't, he don't jump bail when they grant up a court. At the end of the day, more than what? Make I make I put more volume. You see, I'm going to go and watch this video. I want more than watch. More than watch. More than watch this video. I beg, in case of Unano, if you watch this video very well, I go post and see the way they sweat. I go post this video for my for my platform. Just now, I go it go in my comment section. Now, to the issues I do, see, make I first analyze this video for Unano to see why I do on live broadcast. Somebody may kill somebody for a community, for a woman community. Now, they go, they carry police from Abuja. The police from Abuja will come from Abuja and they don't ask state CID. What is the nature of this matter? They don't go to the division, go ask, what is the nature of this matter? They don't go to the area command, go ask, what is the nature of this matter? They don't even go to the zonal authority, go ask, what is the nature of this matter? All of a sudden, they don't begin to arrest people. Now, what are they arresting for? They are arresting that they want to investigate. What kind of investigation are they doing? If at the end of the day, all what they are after is to arrest people and get locked in the cell, to the detriment of the fact that by the time you arrest them and lock in the cell, Another group of persons who go and take over the community, or the group of persons who are paid them. What is the police doing that, like that? They are promoting communal crisis and promoting native war. And promoting native war. So for me, for me, I want to tell the Inspector General of Police. I want to tell the NSA, the National Security Advisor. I want to tell the Chief of Army Staff. Because both soldiers, both police, so all of them, and they make social crisis day for people community for Benin. I don't investigate around. These days now, I know, you know, say, you know, say when you do something over and over again, there's not another form of answer. It's another form of madness. Ziggler, now you talking like that. I don't see and say our Nigerian police force. Now then be the problem we will get for this country. Particularly all those people in the Abuja, we should be superior investigator. So now then be final level of investigation. Now then be the major problem we will get for Nigeria. 
Why are they talking now? This one, I would they arrest. Let me say, person want to tell me. Let me say, I say they can't bring me in the middle of the matter. Would they arrest? After they arrest them, say he keep person. They tell them go court. I will give you before I do state. Now highest bidder. They carry and go court. Now give you before I do state. They grant and be. They don't grant and be at the end of the day. The person never come court since. They no place them for bench warrants. Court they look and say okay. Next agenda they feel like he will show up. He will show up. He don't miss court for more than four sittings. Now, what is going to be the issue at hand? The issue at hand is going to be say, the same person when they go court, where people where let's say, key to their man wife, the same person don't run go Abuja, he don't go write petition to IG, don't use money, they don't approve the petition, they don't do everything they want to make it, make they do. At the end of the day, what is the person not doing? The person is using Abuja police to come and arrest people in the community so that he can take over the community. I ask, is this what policing is all about? Where is the intelligence? Where is the processes of policing that we have? Must we always put paper, uh, laws in papers and don't follow it? Must we always put laws in paper and don't follow it? Why is it that at the end of the day, criminals are the ones using you people police? Criminals! Criminals are the ones using you people that are police. Why is it that it's always like this? When would we as a people, as a country, when would we begin to respect those laws that guide you?
be of this moment, this criminal. What has this boy done? This boy has successfully used SWAT in no tactical unit to come and arrest people in the And after arresting people in the what, what, what has come out of the case that the police now know that the boy used them to come and do the support community over through? They will not arrest the boy. They know that the cops are looking for this boy. This boy has a case of murder on his leg. Because they complain of me, I paid the money. They will let him to go. And I ask, I ask, is this policing? Is this policing? National Security Advisor, Inspector General of Police, uh, Commissioner of Police, uh, Commander from Brigade, and uh, Chief of Army Staff. The work you people are doing in Benin is not helping security. Rather, you people are promoting criminals to oppress other citizens because whether they are good to you or they are your petitioners or you people are there have to carry I don't know. So that's the more reason why I'm coming out this morning to say for the live broadcast. No one thing I record that they talk this on a live video we see ourselves, we hear ourselves because the mentality we have our police is can particularly when they go to the name matter is very, very poor. It's very, very poor. Take it to the bank or anywhere. I will be myself in. and for next week I will not take it upon myself to protest on the streets of Abu Dhabi because what you guys are doing is not helping the state. Both government, both police, both of this one, uh, uh, army, what you guys are doing is not helping the state. And for me, as a comrade, we will not end to not speak and advocate for what we want, which is a better state, which is a, for a state to be governed properly. The police now, they are the ones that come like this. This is very exciting to what all happened. Up to this morning, they have not done anything. Now, somebody who has killed. The victims are still waiting for, for, for justice. What have they done? The, of course, they always collect money. Take it to anywhere. Those state departments of public prosecution. They are one of the worst in Nigeria. One of the worst. So, how about all of this? I want to run because we will only lament on the social media. But what we expect is that after crying, at least for months, let the authorities do what is right. I want to repeat again. National Security Advisor. Inspector General of Police, Chief of Army Staff, Director of GSS, you guys need to sit down and agree on the template to end communal crisis, homicide cases in Benin because your operating are the one encouraging this thing, particularly the police and the military. Particularly the police and the military, the GSS now, they are bringing them fully into it now. They are now, they are now arranging them to be joining them in all this menace. And at the end of the day, Innocent people will be dying. That's like what happened in the former community. You we went to arrest somebody. Two factions are having a case. This one came to light that this one they have guns. And they've been living together for long ago. They did not come as lawful citizens to come and report to the DSS. For the DSS to come and investigate them and arrest them. All of a sudden, they got money and exchange hands. DSS is coming with full force. So they said that when they met this woman, they started shooting this woman, they killed an innocent man. Who had just retired from this hospital and proposal. And what the POS stand to send money to his family. Nobody said anything. But if it was the community leader that has shot somebody, or a group of boys and they shot somebody, to be arresting them. See, Nigeria cannot move forward like this. We will continue talking. We will continue saying what we see and what we know that's really the right thing. It is how the DSS, Chief of Army Staff, uh, Police Commissioner, and IG and DIGs, you guys sit down and ask how you address this. Nonsense in Benin City. I call it nonsense because from my own knowledge, nobody can convince me. I'm saying it. The police and the army and the DSS are the ones in Benin. Because at the end of the day, a criminal complaint to them. They have come to arrest. All the way from Abuja, they will arrive here on the negotiation activity. There's no intelligence sharing to know what is the true fact of what they are coming to investigate. And they will be, oh, the idea has approved. And they are coming to Abuja to Benin to arrest. And come and bring big money. Come and collect big money. That's what they are doing. Money, 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 money. It's all as compromise our police, policing in the United States and Nigeria beyond. I don't want to talk about that thing. So I'm talking about where I live in and what I'm seeing with my eyes. So they say like all those officers that have retired from police work, they are still going to negotiate for criminals. How are you guys enjoying this money? Do you eat this money and and take all of you? Your families. I was arrested. I, 
was arrested by the current AIG because I choose to confront him. Why would you be holding a criminal in your boots? And I'm waiting for the deposition report to be concluded. But at the end of the day, we will talk to the public domain and ask ourselves who is wrong or who is right. Allow me to leave you all for now. I want to beg the general of police. He had a criminal police issue. Now we don't hear from Emmanuel Agbogun. Let us know what you think for this matter. Go to comment section, make you put your own. If you never subscribe to Dan ARG YouTube, try make you subscribe so that make you for the hear all the things where they happen for Nigeria. Make I leave you with this video, make you help or share. Thank you for watching Dan ARG YouTube.